It is a controversial wind farm proposed for the Cumberland Plateau, and today dozens of those opposed to the turbines were at the Capitol lobbying lawmakers. News Channel 5's Chris Conti was there as well, and Chris, residents aren't happy about this. They are not happy, Rory, because the TVA wants to build between 20 and 30 wind turbines up on the plateau. This would be a massive project for that area, and today residents said not so fast. And I live right in the epicenter of where they want to put these. They want to put one on the north side of my home and one on the south side of my home. It would render my home uninhabitable, but they say I'm insignificant. This project is still in its infancy. It would be built by Apex Clean Energy and according to the TVA would be built along 1800 acres near Crossville. There would be 23 turbines in all. The Crab Orchard Wind Project, as it's being called, would be put on private land that would be leased out from owners. Today at the Capitol, lawmakers were meeting to discuss reviewing state policies related to regulating wind energy. And that is why these residents who oppose the plan made the trip to Nashville. A lot of people would say this is clean energy, though. Well, uh, de define clean energy. It's not free. Uh, the turbines only run effectively perhaps 20% of the time. That means you have to have a gas, coal, hydro, nuclear running the 80% of the time. Today, those opposed to the wind farm won a bit of a large victory as a subcommittee voted today to place a moratorium on all wind farms statewide until 2018. That, though, of course, would have to be passed by both the House and the Senate. We are live at the state capitol this evening. Chris Conti, News Channel 5.